Well, so Connecticut officials are trying to crack down on drivers who are speeding on the roads in an effort to keep work zones safe across the state. Lauren Zenzi's in Studio 61 with more details on that. Good morning, Lauren. Yeah, that's right, Tim. It's all a part of the pilot program run by the Connecticut Department of Transportation. It's called the Know the Zone program. So joining us this morning to discuss this uh, in further detail is Josh Morgan from the Department of Transportation. Good morning to you again. Good morning. We have talked about this in the past, but this is something that I want to keep revisiting because it's something that people here in Connecticut are going to be seeing more of, especially now with the summer season. More road work is being done. But you ended up sending me a statistic that said over the last four years, more than 3,600 crashes were in work zones, resulting in 13 deaths and over 40 serious injuries. So talk about this program, the importance of it, and how it's in, all in an effort to keep us as drivers safe, but also the DOT as yeah. well. Yeah, thank you. I mean, those are preventable crashes. So those crashes are attributed to people not paying attention in work zones, speeding through work zones, 13 lives lost because they were doing something they shouldn't have been doing in a work Zone. So the Know the Zone Speed Safety Cam program is a way to change driver behavior, slow people down, and keep people safe. Now, this is not a gotcha program. We've mentioned that before. This is not trying to say, you know, we're just going to ticket everyone that's speeding around this area. But you have gotten close to a 1,000 warnings out so far. No citations as of right now because this is technically the pilot uh, portion of it. But talk about that. Yeah, so the first time someone is uh, speeding more than 15 miles an hour over in the work zone, uh, they're not going to get a citation right away. They'll get a warning, and that's just the first step to say, hey, uh, you were doing something you shouldn't have been. You were doing something dangerous on the roadway. Uh, here's the warning for you in the mail. The data that we have, you know, we sent out uh, close to 1,000 warnings, but we're seeing about 20% of all vehicles speeding through the work zone. So maybe not over that 15-mile-an-hour threshold to actually generate a citation, but 5, 10, going over the speed limit, and that's still dangerous. So 20% of all vehicles are speeding through work zones. And especially when you see the signs, see, uh, you know, it, it makes it very obvious that a work zone is coming, especially when the Department of Transportation is out there. They try and give people enough room to slow down so that we could keep everyone out there safe. So we have an animation for uh, all of our viewers at home because you may be thinking, how in the world does this work? Walk us through what everyone's seeing right now. Yeah, so uh, if someone's going to be uh, driving on the highway, the full first see a sign that says speed camera enforcement ahead. They'll see a second sign uh, letting them know speed cameras are ahead. Then they will pass a white SUV. If they're traveling more than 15 miles an hour over the work zone speed limit, the radar will uh, capture that. Cameras in the front and rear of the vehicle will take pictures of the license plate of the vehicle, and that is what uh, generates uh, a citation automatically. That data is verified with our partners at uh, Connecticut State Police, and then that is a citation that gets mailed to the vehicle's uh, registered owner. Really important information right here, all in an effort to keep all of our workers and all of our drivers out on the road safe. Josh, always a pleasure having you here. Thank like you. you said, not a gotcha campaign, but we want to make sure that all of us are collectively doing our part to make sure everyone out on the roadway stay safe. Tim, I'll send things back over to you. Tim is not a speeder. He only goes the speed limit and oh, travels yes. in the center travel lane. <laughs> yeah, that's me. <laughs> ah, Lauren, thank you.